Let's go to the White House and the briefing room where Peter Ducey is asking a question. Let's watch. What specifically is the president doing about this? So uh, we just talked about uh, uh, the day, the overdose awareness day that, um, uh, that we are uh, observing today. Uh, I just laid out uh, what the second gentleman uh, and uh, others are doing within, within this administration. Uh, and, um, you know, we are going to continue to focus on the uh, the steps that were taken that we have taken. You have the eighty million dollars uh, that DHS just announced uh, today on drug prevention, and the president has taken uh, many steps. He's made this a priority uh, to make sure that we attack a very uh, dangerous, uh, uh, very dangerous drug, serious drugs in this country. But three hundred overdoses a day now. We know how the fentanyl is coming into the country. It's coming right across the southern border. The DEA administrator says so. So when is the president going to do something? So I will it? say that uh, you have seen a 200 percent increase of fentanyl seizures, which means that uh, we are we are doing the job of catching drug traffickers. 200 percent. Hold on. 200 percent increase. Just and again. Americans seizures. life expectancies are going down uh, at a rate not seen in a century. And part of that is being driven by drug overdoses. So what is the president going to do? And we, ag Stop. we agree. We agree. We see those same numbers as well. But the fact that we are, uh, you know, we are securing the border, uh, the fact that we are securing record levels of funding uh, from DHS so they can stop illicit drugs from entering into the country, the, st the fact that uh, it's not just drug traffickers that we're dealing with as well, we're stopping stopping financiers. This is what's happening with this under this administration. But it's Look, not but, being but stopped. Three hundred overdoses. This is being designed to target I, children, drug cartels. In I Mexico, hear you. want to kill American kids. What is this president doing about it? I hear you. I just I just laid out 200 percent of increase of drug fentanyl seizures. That is a dangerous drug that we are taking off the street. We are going to continue to focus. This is an important, important priority for this president. And I just want to talk about how you're saying that they're, you know, they're just the, the border, right? And how the border, whatever you just stated, I just want to clear this up. Migrants People are coming who coming in, fentanyl's coming in, people are dying. Hold Hold on. So migrant migrants who attempted to enter the country illegal, illegally are taken into custody by border patrol agents. That is how it works. That is the process that we are taking. They are then either expelled by the court order under Title 42, transferred to ICE uh, custody, or monitored through alternatives to detention program as they await further processing. We have made 3,000 arrests in the first three months of launching an aggressive campaign to combat the multi-billion dollar human smuggling industry. When it comes to, when it comes to what's happening with drug overdose, this is something that the president cares about. This is something that the president has laid out a plan to make sure that our kids, our babies, our you know, young Americans here in this country are not continuing to suffer from that, are not continuing to be given or access to drugs. This is something that's incredibly important to this president. So to say that we're not doing enough, Peter, is just falsely, categorically wrong, especially on a day that we are observing what needs to be done. And, and we have announced, DHS has announced, $80 million to prevent that. So we are doing the work. And here's the thing, Peter, if Look, if Republicans want to help us stop overdose and stop our kids getting overdose because of these dangerous drugs, because of these fentanyl that we're seeing in the streets, we're happy to work with them. But they're not. I'm moving on. I'm moving on. I'm moving on. I'm moving on. Get. Get, get. No, get. Okay. Hey, Sean Hannity here. Hey, click here to subscribe to Fox News YouTube page and catch our hottest interviews and most compelling analysis. You will not get it anywhere else.